Welcome back to the Conor Moore Show. So much uncertainty right now, we all have questions. I mean, when can we golf again? When will the pros play again? When will Conor get out of his apartment and into the studio? But let's stick to what we know. The LPGA is set to return in July and the PGA is set to return in June with no fans. But what about the Ryder Cup? I mean, can we really play the Ryder Cup without fans? Honestly, I looked for a good video of the US team celebrating, I just couldn't find one. Wasn't a whole lot to choose from. So, European captain Paddy Harrington says we gotta take one for the team and play this one without fans. Rory McIlroy's not so sure. Uh, Rory, you do know we are away this year. No fans means no home field advantage, no jeering, no USA, USA, think. We've officially gotten to that part of the quarantine. I watched three YouTube tutorials, talked to his barber, Oh, you watched three YouTube tutorials. Okay. Ah, uh, you talked to his barber. Great. And you had your fingers crossed. Seems like a solid plan there. This isn't coming out for a while. Let's see what's behind door number one. <laughs> oh, this side is so bad. <laughs> well, the good thing is I got my mustache, so. It's a good distraction. <laughs> Sorry, Brooks. There is no mustache alive that distracting. Look on the bright side. Now the door is open to try some new styles, like a young Rory McIlroy. Or John Daly. Or a Dennis Rodman. He definitely cuts his own hair. Evidently, home cuts are a risk. So is homeschooling. What shape is that? All right, let's take a second to appreciate what this kid accomplished. He's hitting a driver off the deck with a narrow fairway and a chatty gallery. His ma shouldn't be yelling at him, she should be praising him. He pretty much had a dartboard to aim at and he hit the bullseye. You know when you think of humble guys in golf history, you think of Arnold Palmer, Byron Nelson, Ian Poulter. Okay, maybe not Poulter, but it would be hard to find someone as humble as Henrik Stenson. So we thought it'd be fun to send him to headquarters to only talk about himself and his Open Championship win from 2016. Hi, good morning. I'm Henrik Stenson, 2016 Open Champion. I'm here to uh, answer some questions about uh, one of the best tournaments ever played. Yeah, it's kind of the same here. The hairdo I had back in 2016, I think it was, it was working pretty good back then. Close your eyes real quick. Yeah, it looks great. So we're going to come up with some trivia questions, ask you if you remember these moments and see if you get those right. Sure. So. <laughs> but this is all like current stuff, nothing current from things. like 2016. No. Yeah, so we're talking yeah. Olympic, Open. Open, um, Ryder Cup. Troon. Um, but nothing here on like Troon or... No. I did, did some interviews after the Open in 16 and it wasn't quite right, so I want to make sure it's right now. So that's going to be that first segment, and then second... Can I answer like true on all the questions? Yes, just answer yeah. true oh, okay. true It would be great to get some, some stuff on, about true. Yeah, we can get that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, we have like some, some like... Yes. Cool. Yeah. The value of sub-60 rounds in the game right now. Sunday 63s are almost the same though, aren't they? Well, his heckling from Dan's okay. okay. So we will read some of Jay Monahan's recent quotes on saying, you know, it's part of what's made. There wasn't much heckling at the Open in 2016. <laughs> Let's bring it back to bed. Cheering, cheering on, yeah. <laughs> this almost looks the same as the... Is that from that golf court at, at Truman that Todd Lewis took me to, to the press conference, I wonder? It's probably a similar one. Yeah. How did you look at home for just a second? How was your, uh, how was your... That's almost as sad as handing back to Claire Jug that. Yeah. How dare you not do Morning. What are you all watching? Open highlights from 2016? Open highlights. Yeah. And the 2016 Open champ, Henrik Stenson. I think it was one of the, uh, one of the best ones, right? It was. One of my favorite first. Yeah. Not, not that I want to mention it. 